Welcome to My Pillow Show with host Lisa Hill, where we transform lives by inspiring others. And today we're going to be hearing about the amazing entrepreneur, Mr. Mike Lindell from the My Pillow Company. And we'll be right back with a word from our sponsor. It's a three-piece interlocking system. It's an open cell poly, poly foam that won't go flat for 10 years. It's an amazing, and a pillow will always look like this. I warranty it for 10 years or you get a new pillow. It'll always be like this, even through washing and drying, which is amazing. Uh, that you that will stay like that through throughout no matter how many wash and dry but the, the, the fill and the and what that does is the most amazing thing all three sizes are mixed in every pillow it's an interlocking system and there's a percentage of each one that uh, that interlock together so you get a nice smooth feel it all feels real soft but what it does the most amazing thing wherever you set this pillow wherever you get comfortable at the level that you, your comfort level by keeping your cervical nerve straight it'll hold that It'll hold that all night long. Every one of my pillows is soft, but they they support you. So the, the, ideally, you would want you would want your you want something that was soft but yet supportive, and that's what my pillow is. It'll all feel nice and soft, and, and but it would imagine a million little springs holding your head in the right position for you, and that's what you have with my pillow. My pillow is not intended as a cure for any disease. However, it can help reduce discomfort associated with symptoms of common physical problems because nothing is more important to good overall health than a great night's sleep. Welcome back. We are here with Mike Lindell the inventor and CEO and founder of a, one of the fastest growing companies in America today. And he has also been featured in every newspaper across the country. Uh, and he also is an individual that is employing people by the hundreds here in Minnesota and changing lives uh, and homes and creating a wonderful family within this community that we call Minnesota, Carver, Minnesota. So welcome, Mike. Thank you, Lisa. This is a fantastic show sponsored by your company. Yeah. yeah we I know that you're growing so fast right now. We're going to have, I guess you're going to have lots of different yes on here. Yes, um, absolutely. Because what the, the reason is, is because you inspire people on a daily basis. And I know that you like to give back and you like to continue, mm -hmm. you know, through your inspiration. So your company sponsoring this show to bring others, to inspire others, is truly yeah. what I believe you're all about. Right. And, the, you know, it wants, uh, and then eventually I'll tie it into our uh, the foundations to help it inspire people and help people. And this... Uh, you know, I, there's my story in itself is it amazes me even you know with uh, with all the things that have happened in my life and and how uh, God has helped me and and uh, get me through. So when you started the My Pillow Company, I know you're you're eight years old, correct? Eight years ago. Yeah. Eight years ago, you started the company called My Pillow. Right. And I know you're changing thousands of lives. I know the first time I came and visited with you, I was amazed at all the different, you know, testimonials and people had called in about how right. this pillow had done amazing things in their lives. Mm -hmm. And uh, that must make you feel really good on a daily basis that you are truly changing people's lives from that avenue. Yeah, that's, that's always been uh, my, one of my biggest driving force. I love hearing the testimonials from people. And to be honest, the the... I mean, it's. I hear them all the time. I've been walking down the street now since I am recognized that they uh, they'll come up and help, tell me how it's changed their life. The pillow has actually changed their life, and <clears throat> whether it be uh, um, just feeling better all around, feeling better, or it's been some disorder where it's helped uh, relieve the the symptoms of you know everything from fibromyalgia to migraines to headaches. Uh, uh, snoring problems, sleep apnea, you know, all these different things. And that even amazes me because when I invented this pillow, I didn't, I just invented it for my own comfort and, and uh, wow. it just spun off and it's just, it helps so many people that it's, it's, it's still amazing. And that's, that, it, which actually gave me the theory that I have of where sleep comes from, which I want to prove one of these days. So when you first started the company, Mike, you had a vision and you had a dream and you had, you know, what you wanted to do with this amazing, you know, uh, pillow that you created, this mm -hmm. invention. Mm -hmm. Could you ever imagine where you'd be today? Well, sure. No. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, yeah. Wouldn't you imagine? Yeah. Did you imagine? Yeah, yeah. No, I, I, I have a big visions, and I think everybody should. I think that you should ever let your visions uh, and your dreams. Um, you got to keep, you know, keep dreaming, no matter what. And they. Uh, my book's called Against the Wind, and that says it all. I went through so many, so many blockades and so many 
uh, the most people that know me can you cannot imagine what has happened to me um, at different points in my life and almost on a weekly basis and which most people would have given up most people would have uh, done worse than given up and they uh, and even through all that not just giving up I still have the dream where I'm at now and I really did have that dream and really did have that um, you know that I knew someday it would become a reality and I never I never stopped believing that ever and through everything and when the first developing the pillow <clears throat> there were so even just little things like developing it. well now you have to get uh, uh, permission from the government to get this in the pillow and and then to get a patent on the pillow I mean that's in a that's registered trademark of. yeah that's unheard of in this I think anyway I, I'm pretty proud of the the my pillow trademark just to get a trademark oh, yes. I did that myself and they it was one of the first Mai's in the United States, and I, I believe every Mai, I believe, spun off of that. I that still is believe so that. cool. Yeah. You know, they, uh, now so it's cool. my everything, my, you know, my 29, my twin, my everything. And, <laughs> and, um, and at first, when I first said my pillow, it sounded kind of, you know, geeky, but, but, you know, you'd always say, where's my pillow? Well, now they, uh, uh, it's become a reality. It's well, everywhere. You know, it's everywhere, yeah. And, and it was, but back then it was just, you'd get, I'd get to one point, well then I finally knew it was going to be in the pillow and there was no machine that made the cuts that I needed for the sizes I had envisioned and I had to basically invent that and then, wow. then you get to that point and then I wanted, a lot of the stuff though I would just get, you know, in, in uh, dreams or from God I would say, I would so, you know, basically say, well I want something to be, you know, keep out the dust mites or to be, um, well, all of a sudden it would come up, you know, with this wow. technology, and I'd ask him, I'd say, here's what I envision, and then the scientists would make it for me, and it would, and it would work. And, or, you know, I want a pillow you can wash and dry, I want a pillow that does, I wanted it to do everything, I wanted it to stay cool and everything, but I had no idea what I had created as far as how it would change everybody's lives, not just get them sleep, change their lives, because that deep sleep cycles you need, is where all your uh, health comes from. And I firmly believe the most important thing to your health is sleep, and it the is. most important really thing, thing to your sleep is my pillow. That's it. Um, I love what you just said right there. Right. Most important thing to your sleep is my pillow. Right. Because we know that <clears throat> one of the top uh, reasons people go to buy over the counter medications is to help them sleep. Right. And we know that that's right. only masking really the symptoms. And what we've learned now working with you right. is what exactly happens with the cervical nerves in the right. neck. Right, right. Well, how my theory, you helps. know, my theory that I'm, and I'm pretty proud of that. That's one of the things after, uh, after um, years of hearing back from people of why, you know, why the pillow worked and and or how the pillow worked and all these things it's doing it well it's helping hey, I don't have migraines anymore my arms not asleep anymore my neck's not sore yeah. anymore all these different things and I'm going well okay you know and they're not snoring and they're and they're you know they're getting deeper sleep they're feeling better <clears throat> well I didn't I started uh, theorizing and checking into the things well here it's very simple they, they have eight cervical nerves in your neck and your vertebral and your arteries by keeping them straight and not collapsing um, your body, you know, you know, it relaxes every muscle in your body by those being held straight mm -hmm. and kept cool. And it's, uh, if you know that, and we have the only product that does that for you, it just, it's amazing, you know, that the two are tied together, that nobody's come up with this before. And I, I think it comes back to where pillows changed in the 1970s, mm -hmm. where they went with fiber fill and hollow fill made overseas. And I remember when I was a kid and how... I had these pillows that were different, and they would and they would support me all night. And I can never forgot that. I'd be laying on this department store floors at, you know, f 13 years old, looking around, and nobody's looking. <laughs> lay there, and you probably and, do that now. Yeah, well, no, I quit doing that because I know I got the only one that works. Yeah. But I did do that <laughs> up until a few years ago, or up until I invented the pillow. But I even, you know, when I was seeing a chiropractor back in the day, I said, why don't they make a pillow that stays supportive so my arms not asleep, my mm -hmm. neck's not sore. Mm -hmm. Um, you know, I, I wake up and I uh, feel like I need a nap in the afternoon and, you know, one that fits me, you know, when I first get comfortable, it wouldn't stay there. And the chiropractor said, there's nothing out there like that, that you can, you know, and uh, basically I wanted something you could adjust like feather, but wouldn't collapse like feather. And that's kind of the whole theory. That's amazing that you <clears throat> invented something yeah. like that. It's like uh, <coughs> to get a patent on a pillow that's 100%, I believe I have one of the few Patents on a pill mainly 100% in the United States and all the materials, you know. 
And, uh, and that's another thing that's <coughs> real close to your heart is made in America. Right, right. We're never, I'm never going to make any part of this pill overseas unless it would take an act of God where, you know, the cotton fields in the United States mm -hmm. or something would, uh, you know, right, enough of them are bought, you know, enough of them are being bought now by overseas and we ship them over there and they ship us back poly cotton blends. That's crazy. But, but uh, it would take where we couldn't get it and I'd have to really weigh, well, if I got to get it there, in order for these people to be mm -hmm. helped here, I might change my mind. But right now, I'm I'm in uh, I'm in with uh, uh, one of the last big mills in the United States, and they're basically going to keep right. me going. So they're going right. to buy buy up enough cotton gray goods to keep us going. So we're so we're being supplied by uh, you know keep everybody in supply because it's amazing hearing the stories and and uh, I remember that one story, Mark, that you, Mike, that you were talking about <coughs> with a, a gentleman. I believe he had cerebral palsy. That just couldn't get comfortable. No, he had multiple and muscle multiple, dystrophy. Okay. Yeah, and he can't move his upper torso, and that's happened more than once. We have. <clears throat> this is where I came up with the the neck theory. We have not just him, but now I've heard it numerous times, where people can't move even even in um, <clears throat> nursing homes and stuff, where where they can't move their upper torso or whatever. And when they, you know, this kid was asking for, um, you know, he'd ask for water or food or whatever, and wake, you know, wake the parents up all night long. And really that wasn't the need. The need was when he got back then, they'd refluff his pillow, that pillow would collapse where you and I would use our arms oh, or fold sure, our pillow. Sure. He just wanted uh, to stay comfortable. And mm. it would become, uh, you know, once that pillow collapsed, if you can't move, you know, if you're in a nursing home, or I've, I've dealt with uh, quadriplegics, <coughs> and paraplegics, mm -hmm. And they can't move their bodies, and they same thing. They're they're hollering for help to their nurses sure. to get to get removed. And and another thing that comes up there is heat. Also, heat will you know where they're flipping the pillow, so they'll come in, they'll readjust them, so they're not getting bed sores, whatever, and, and whatever. And <clears throat> the pillow pulls heat from you. It keeps you cool, keeps your necks in, in the right position. So it's amazing. You know. Oh, that's awesome, Mike. Yeah. I know that we have to take a break and uh, go back to our sponsor, My Pillow. Mm -hmm. And in your turn, I know that you have some other information for us that, mm -hmm. you know, people can sleep better at night. Yep. So thank you. Now a word from our sponsor. The uh, pillows that you sleep on now, they go flat, you use your arm, you fold the pillow, you're always out trying to buy the right, th the right size for you, whether it's thin, uh, thick, um, side sleeper, back sleeper, stomach sleeper. Well, most of us sleep on all the positions. We go around the, around the clock. We sleep side, stomach, back, all over the place. Well, the great thing about my pillow is it doesn't matter which position you sleep in, and here's why. I have a patented fill where all three, there's three different sizes in each pillow, and they're all mixed together, and they interlock. It's an interlocking system. Wherever you move this pillow, wherever, they all feel nice and soft, but wherever you move it, it holds that position. I don't know if you can see that. Wherever I move this, if I want it higher, it stays higher. So if I'm crunching up my pillow, I get exactly what I need for me. And that's what sleep is all about. By keeping your cervical nerves in your neck straight, your vertebral arteries straight, all the, arter all the arteries and nerves in your neck, keeping them straight so the signals and the blood flow is great, that's when you're getting this great sleep and you're not getting these interruptions where your body's trying to keep your head supported all night. So you adjust it, you push in from the side just like you would. When I tell people when you're on your side, just get yourself comfortable and it'll hold that, okay? It takes six pounds of pressure to hold that in position. Your average head weighs 12 pounds. So so wherever you make it, you can um, you set it, it's going to hold that all night long. Now, if you're on your back, interestingly enough, we've all seen them curved pillows that go like this. Well, pillows give you support here and here and nothing where your C1 and C2 is, your, your axis and your atlas. Those, those two uh, cervical nerves and cervical vertebrae, they, uh, they need support, okay? And with my pillow, you can get that. You can adjust, you, you're on your back, you just take it and you tuck right in there, you tuck in that quick crock of your neck, so to speak, and you get, you get the, and you, people say, well, how much do I tuck in there? You will know that, your body knows, you're going, wow, this is great, I'm very comfortable. It'll stay that way all night and give you the support you need. So basically, because you can move the fill and they interlock, you can move it anywhere you want, it's gonna hold that position. Welcome back to My Pillow Talk with host Lisa Hill, and I'm joined by the inventor, CEO, and president of My Pillow, 
Mike Lindell. Mike Lindell, you're a friend to everybody that meets you, and you literally have changed thousands of lives already. We were talking briefly before about you know how you got started, uh, what the company looks like. Maybe you can go into a little bit. You know, there may be somebody out there that has not heard about the pillow, and exactly how that how that pillow came about, and exactly how it was created, and what it does. Well, I had uh, I had problems sleeping, and. Uh and it, uh, I'd always wake up, my neck would be sore, my arm would be asleep, I'd be flip-flopping, folding my pillow, and it would be flipping it to the cool side, and I would always feel like I needed a nap, and, and uh, I was seeing a chiropractor, whatever the chiropractor did, I would be right back seeing him again five days later because mm -hmm. it wouldn't maintain what the work he had done, and it was, uh, you know, it was costing me a lot of money seeing the chiropractor, but I'd walk out of there and go, why am I seeing him? And I didn't know why. I didn't attribute a pillow mm -hmm. to anything related to my neck problems or even my sleep, for that matter. I thought a pillow is a pillow is sure. a pillow. And what I've learned, and I think what the public's learning, too, is a pillow is not a pillow is a pillow. Um, the average American has six pillows per person per household. Wow. We keep buying them and buying them, and they go flat. They're made to go flat. They're made to... Th the, I, they're, according to the National Sleep Foundation, it's like the number one non-disposable product sold that doesn't work. You just, you know, that's... Um, your sleep all comes from... Now, I've, I've known this since I've had the product we said in the first segment. comes from your neck being held straight, so your, your cervical nerves can relax your muscles which is better than any sleeping pill you'll ever take. And the way my pillow works is they, um, there's three different sizes of an open cell polyfoam that, uh, that lasts 10 years that won't go flat and break down. It's the same pillow on day one as it is on year 10. And as you, wherever you move that pillow, when you first get comfortable at night, it's going to hold your cervical nerves and your neck. Imagine when you first get comfortable, if you could, sure, at least, if sure. you could stay in that position and... Right how comfortable you feel well that's not your that's not your face your body you know your whole body feels comfortable it doesn't matter what bed you're sleeping in by the way mm -hmm. when your neck is it's just like the old-fashioned tvs that have the old uh, dials with the horizontal yeah. hole yep. all of a sudden ding 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 and and you're, you're once you're comfortable there and your body has a built-in mechanism my pillow holds you there and you're not and then another thing you're not flipping it to the cool side the two biggest reasons people come out of rem deep delta or stage three and four sleep is because or they call it sleep interruptions the reason you get them is because your neck's bent and you know i'm going to prove sense. this theory. yeah i'm going to prove this theory because your blood flow is not right and your cervical nerves are bent well my pillow will hold them in the right position for you as an individual we make different thicknesses we and to get you the right amount of my fill they're all soft, but they all uh, support it, but yet support it. And what they do, they all stay cool, too. You're not flipping them to that cool side. You know, you, oh, that's you awesome. Know, um, they, uh, a lot of people have sweating problems, and that's the second biggest reason people wake up. First, be your, your neck being bent. The second is heat. And uh, the third is to go to the bathroom, and, I, and it's not proven yet we can help that. <laughs> but uh, but they, uh, that those are the three biggest reasons people wake up at night. The other, one, the other reasons are all excuses. Uh, you're, you're to get something to eat, to drink, or to watch TV. You have woke up, your body has woke you up out of those, because you've had a sleep interruption. And my pillow also, it has a fiberproof ticking on it that keeps out the skin cells the dust mites feed on, so that I, it covers the other aspect. I wanted it to do everything. Mm -hmm, I wanted mm -hmm. it to be good for everybody, um, to not just work for a certain segment of people. And uh, I wanted it to be allergy-free. It's non-allergenic, antimicrobial, but they keep out the skin cells the dust mites feed on, so they have no reason to be in there. But if they, oh, that's if they, awesome. Yeah, if they are in there... People with allergies or asthma, you throw the whole pill in the wash and dryer. They dry in an hour like your favorite blue and jeans. And that's unheard of. Yeah, it's unheard of. They don't ball up. It's the same pillow. And I even went a step further because people are so tired of getting burned on pillows that uh, I give a 60-day money-back guarantee. I've been doing it for eight years, and we back that. We have no, you know... Um, no amazing. complaints with the Better Business else Bureau. That does yeah, that. not no, not with pillows. Mm -hmm. I mean, they would be. No. They couldn't do it, and and uh, we uh, we also have a ten year warranty of not going flat. So you're basically it's the most amazing product I think for. I think sleep deprivation in this country is one of the biggest problems we face mm -hmm. because our productivity is down. We feel tired during the day. Sure. Um, you know, obviously the people that sell energy drinks don't feel that way. They're making a fortune. You know, they, I know. You know, I know. and, and uh, but even, you know, everything comes from your sleep. I mean, they even say, you know, um, uh, strokes, your diabetes, all these things 
are off things of bad sleep. And what I've learned from doctors and from the Sleep Association and from hearing from people how mm -hmm. it's improved all these different disorders. We're not out to, I'm not saying my pill is going to, you know, cure any of these things, but it gets you sleep, which in turn, sleep gets you so relief important. of all the, it's like a, a domino effect, but it's a great domino effect. It's yeah. like a, you know, you don't feel like any, here's a good example. We have these, I have these in fire departments throughout uh, Minnesota and Iowa, and they need sleep fast, and they need to be sure. with uninterrupted sleep. They get more good sleep than, than you know, in a two, three hour period than an average person gets in eight hours. You Makes know, sense. That doesn't have a wow. my pillow, you know. Makes perfect and sense. And it's, uh, it's just been amazing. Um, I, in, in Minnesota here, that's where I, my factory's at, and we do all of, I do all my own manufacturing, all my own call center, um, we do everything, for ev everything. Um, I want, I like being hands-on and, because um, I'm so particular, I want, it's not, uh, for me, I could have sold out and either had, there's two things that have happened. Big companies want me off mm -hmm. the market because they don't, when the, mm -hmm. the average American keeps buying pillows over and over again, they want their, they don't want the product there, buy out the patents, mm -hmm. shove it on the table like the cars that got 200 miles a gallon. Or the other one is, hey, we, now we'll sell your product in our, you know, in our retail store. Well, that's not going to happen because control over the individual experience. I want, right. in our company, if we get a call by someone and that pillow didn't work for them, we find out why. And, we, and it's always because they, get, they ordered the wrong loft mm -hmm. or something. There's something else going on. And we try and work with them one-on-one. -on -one. Uh, that's very rare, Mike. Yeah, yeah. And that's, you know, that's, that's going back rare. to 1950s uh, customer service. Exactly. And, you know, and you know, but that's the way I do all my business too. I don't, you know, in this day and age, a handshake is what I, you know, I trust you, trust me. We work together. All my, um, all my supplier links here from most of them are from the Midwest here that supply the, uh, um, and uh, then I have the national mill with the with the uh, with my ticking, but nothing's made overseas, and we're not going into any retail and. Uh, the admiration that people have around you as I watch, you know, the employees and, mm -hmm. um, <clears throat> you know, we had a Christmas party right. and at the Christmas party, those, you know, the employees that would come up and talk about how, you know, how excited they were to be able to work at this company and the comments that were being said about how, you know, Mike answers his own phone calls and right. he's so right. particular right. that all the customers are being taken care of mm -hmm. and, um, you know, you're caring right. for kinda, your, your employees plus your customers. Right. It's kind of funny. The employees, though, I'll say, you know, call me, call me, call me, call Mike, call Mike. Call Mike, call Mike. <laughs> and, and, I, and they're afraid, you know, some are afraid when they first come on, they're going, well, we're not going to call the, you know, the owner of this huge company. And I want to be hands-on because I want the same service given to people I had eight years ago. That's what I work for and live for is these people coming up to me saying, this is amazing that you're doing this, not only for to help. We care, you know, I want my company to care. If you can't even work for my company, if you haven't had tried the pillow, because now you're believing right. in from the heart as you're making it, as you're selling mm -hmm. it, as you're helping mm -hmm. these people from my operators that help you on the phone. And it's amazing because most of the people, if, if I ever do get complaints, it's complaints about um, something that they haven't bought the pill. You know, how can this do this? You know, they're already complaining because they've... they've the unbelievers. The unbelievers. <laughs> I mean, it's just, uh, you know, it's like, okay, I don't know what to tell you, but, uh, you know, it's a 60-day money-back guarantee. If you try it, it doesn't work, I'll give you your money back, but it always works. So, you know, I don't know what else I can say, you know. And the infomercial he just did is uh, so successful. Well, you're one of the, the most men watched in, in America right now. Yeah, you know? My goodness, the infomercial is just, just absolutely yeah. doing wonderful things. And then just your, you know, the credibility that you've given, yeah. um, you know, the pillow itself right. to well, go out there and change even lives. In my advertising, I wanted it to come from the heart. And we've got, they're called cascades. They're in every paper in the country from the Wall Street Journal to the New York Times. And I've been impeached in them like 30 times. And, and I get calls all the time from marketers going, this is, this is against the all marketing 101. <laughs> well, you know, I've always done stuff different than the normal public. And that's why my book's called Against the Wind. Yep. I mean, it's, uh, I want, uh, it's not going to be exactly what, what society says you should do because it's not all, you know, there's not a perfect path for people, you know. It's, uh, uh, and the easy path isn't always right, the right path. You're right, and, Mike. And, Absolutely and that's right. The, you know, people are too busy taking the easy path. Well, okay, I can be lazy, go this way, and stay in the status quo, or I can go this way and make something happen that changes lives and changes people and changes the world. 
Well, Mike, truly, you're one of the most inspirational people I've ever met. I tell you that all the time, <laughs> but he truly is. You know, your heart and how you genuinely care about people mm -hmm. and how you've, you've grown this fantastic company here in Minnesota. And I know that you have plans to have, <clears throat> you know, um, well, jobs and employment yeah. all over the United States. Yeah. And yeah. now with your foundation, we'll be getting to more of that. But right. um, I know that I look forward to visiting and continuing to work closely with you and yeah. everybody at the My Pillow. Yeah. I have and, visions um, of one in every five people having My Pillow within three years. And they will. <laughs> yes. The rates are growing right yeah, now. Yeah, oh my goodness. Yeah. In the people's lives. So yeah. um, thank you so much, Mike, for being on this show. And I know that you have your own show that's going to be next. Uh, following the show so thank you everybody for joining my pillow talk with host Lisa Hill and of course the the sponsor and CEO president and inventor of my pillow fitting you with a my pillow is very important so that you get the right amount of fill for you as an individual Every pillow you buy nowadays, you, they're saying, because my pillow is adjustable, we just need to figure out how much fill in there is required to keep your neck always in the right position for you. All my pillows are soft. That's one fallacy. People say, well, I want firm or I want soft. They're all soft, but they support you. So all we need to get is the right, the right size for you, and that's what we're going to do. I'm going to simplify it. Every pillow has a color-coded tag. Uh, this is the green level, blue level, white level, uh, yellow level. And that coordinates to how much fill is in each pillow. We're going to start out with the yellow level. The yellow level is for, your, for children 10 years of age or under. It's also for stomach sleeping women that only sleep on their stomach. It is also for um, very petite women, uh, they're five foot, you know, four, five foot one, five foot or below. And um, it, what it is, that'll, that'll give them enough, or very narrow shoulders. Uh, you get into the white level here. This is for almost all women. This, this pillow here typically is a, uh, every, every woman, that no matter what position, sleep position you sleep in, uh, it's also for smaller men. I would say five, eight, five, nine and under. And uh, unless they're real stock, you have real broad shoulders. But basically all women and, and smaller guys or shorter guys. The green level is for most guys. Almost all guys up to us, maybe six foot one. It's got enough fill in there for, uh, for almost every guy all the way up to an XL shirt. And it's also for larger women uh, that have broader shoulders. Maybe a woman that just sleeps on her side that has broader shoulders because you need more height for your side sleeping than you do for your back or your stomach. But the green level is almost all men. The, uh, the blue level is for one person and that's the guy a guy that with over six foot one or a guy that's very broad stocky shoulders he needs the height for his size sleeping Mo almost no woman takes this size pillow they uh it's very very thick it's got a lot of loft it's soft but it's got a lot of loft and it's please do not buy this one because it, it's not going to go flat uh, none of my pillows do they're going to stay what you get is what it is so don't buy up thinking it's going to be like a conventional pillow that goes flat it's going to be the same on day one as it is on year nine there's one more pillow i have left here and that's my red we call it our big red and that red pillow is for one person and one person only it's a it's a guy that is a huge shoulders that only sleeps on his side. He needs the height for his, for his side sleeping to take the pressure off his shoulders. And this pillow is that you cannot sleep on your back no matter who you are. So this pillow is only for one person that's a large, very large man that only sleeps on his side. And another thing too, this all go, these colors all go for the same for king size pillows. Uh, this, it works exactly the same. You got your thinnest loft being your yellow, white, green, blue, and then the red. And I can't say it enough that don't buy them thinking they're going to go flat at night. This is what my pillow is all about. It's going to stay where you put it and it's going to hold there like a million springs holding you up. It's so important that you just listen to what I've just said on the video here. Uh, we do have the 60, mon 60 day money back guarantee. But you're not going to want to re ever return this pillow if you get fitted right. Obviously, if, I, if you bought this blue pillow and it bent your neck on the upright, you're not going to like it. So I'm, that's, that's why fitting is so important. And if you follow what I just told you, it's going to be an amazing sleep.